Well, the Omaha Nation Public School Board continues to face backlash from concerned parents and community members today after one of their contracted employees was arrested for possessing firearms on school grounds. 66-year-old Gregory Schoenfelder, the head of maintenance at the school, is being held on a $100,000 bond in Thurston County Jail. He is facing four charges involving firearms because he's a convicted felon. During a public school board meeting this morning, KCAU was initially denied access to the meeting, but was later allowed to entry without a camera. The video you're seeing now was shot on a cell phone. During the meeting, more than 20 community members questioning school board members about Schoenfelder's past and why he was hired to work at the school. They did not respond to questions. However, in a statement sent to KCAU later today, the school board said Schoenfelder was a contracted worker and did not have to undergo a background check before being hired. That's something some parents say has to change. I was very dissatisfied. Just the fact that I asked if our school was safe, deemed safe, and what measures were taken, and they, they wouldn't even answer. I think in um, letting the people, the parents know, the, our children know that their safety is, is a concern, that it is a priority. Well, the parents you just heard from were forced to leave the school campus where the meeting was held in order to speak with KCAU. Schoenfelder is no longer contracted by the school. The Omaha Nation School Board's president says the board intends to review its background check process, policies, and practices.